Hey guys, this is Mr. Wolfie, and I am going to show you how to make a Let's Play. Alright guys, so things you'll need to make at least a average looking Let's Play, or an average looking Let's Play. I guess that would be proper English, and I mean, I'm all about proper English now. You know, you've heard me talk. Alright, so, uh, the things you'll definitely need. Um, your computer doesn't have to be wonderful if you're recording off of a console game. So basically, I use a program called Cyberlink Power Director. I'm using 10 now. It's a little bit better than 9. I was using 9 for pretty much everything. Um, and it's got some really good audio recording uh, abilities. So I go to that. Right now, I'm sitting on that screen. I'm actually recording my voice right now. Um, actually, I'll show you. I don't know if you can see it, but that's what the screen looks like. Tell you what, I'll fraps it in a minute and it'll be better. So that'll be yet another thing you can use. You need fraps. F-A-R-F-R-A-P-S. Farps. Okay, uh, then you're going to need a DVD player or DVD burner. I don't have a capture card, so I use a DVD burner and I use DVD... Oh! I use DVD RWs, which means you can rewrite them. So I can use the same DVD for like an entire Let's Play. Just, re, you know, get as much as I can on it once, uh, do the editing to it, erase the DVD, and start over again. Which is really, really, really handy, because these things are a little expensive, but, you know, you could buy a pack for $20 and never need another pack if you use them properly. So, that helps. Uh, the DVD burner, I don't know how much we paid for it. It's, it was kind of a cheap, low-end one we got on uh, Black Friday a couple years ago, and it is awesome. I use it for so much stuff. I use it for my commentary videos, I use it for my let's plays, all that jazz. Uh, so basically what we're going to do, I'm going to actually show you in steps. I'm actually going to play uh, 007 for the Wii, that GoldenEye Reloaded or whatever. Uh, I'm starting the third level, which is the nightclub in Barcelona. And I'm going to show you step by step what I do to actually get a let's play going, and then I'm going to kind of make a compilation video of it all. So what I'm going to do now, because I'm still recording my voice, is I'm going to hit the Fraps button. Make sure Fraps is going. I don't know if it's going. Just a second. Just a second. Watch it. Watch it. Okay, so I'm recording on the tape now. I'm about to hit this uh, button, which will record my voice on PowerDirector, and then it will actually replace the voice that's coming out of the tape, because it'll sound much better. So here we go. So I count down... It's got a three second countdown. I hit record on the DVD player. I'll wait just a moment for it to get set up because it has a, a bit of a lag. And then I go three, two, one. Hey guys, it's Mr. Wolfie, and we're playing some more GoldenEye 007 for the Wii. At that point, it's just a matter of taking the video and editing the parts that are necessary out of the video and syncing up the audio to the DVD clips which will allow you to create the LP as you want it and then I add my little dude in the corner like in this video which is actually the video that you're watching now I'm working on editing it just add my little dude in the corner there and then I shrink him down you can drag and drop and whatever you need to do and it works out perfectly because PowerDirector is very handy like that. You can do a lot of picture within a picture things. But anyway guys, uh, I'm going to do some more of these. If you have any questions, ask and I will do a video devoted to explaining some things. So feel free to post in the comments anything you might want to hear. Uh, I hope this helps some of you people that are looking for ways to make Let's Plays better. Or make Let's Plays in general. I hope this helps you out. But I will see you guys later. This has been Mr. Wolfie. Peace out.